Fine, thank you. Una call me Omoka. Hmm. What's your name? Uh, my name is Ali. Just one name. I, I want you to give uh, it some zest. You, you're uh, introducing yourself to the show for uh, the first my name, time. My name is. Yeah, my name is Leku Simon Eremugo. Uh -huh. That's uh, my original name, but then my uh, my music name is Alotonda. Mm hmm. Nice to meet you. I want to teach you a word. Kuomoka. <laughs> Kunamim. King sleep. <laughs> There's a way that when you're trying to explain to rich kids what is Kuomoka. Now, I'm going to More of learning about Kuomoka is. What is Kuomoka? Translation. Making it. Uh, yeah. Aha. You look like you done made it. You made it. You've blown. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tell us about your new track. Oh, my, uh, the, the latest one? Or mm -hmm. the... Yes, please. Uh, the latest song uh, I thought he was released, I think it was at the, I don't remember the release date, but it was just about a month ago. Uh, and uh, this song was uh, actually crazy words. It was inspired by, I think you guys would probably already know, inspired by a, a famous a classic, I thought he by Bajibaji Baji and Giddy Giddy. Uh, uh, this song here yeah, was basically restructured by, what you know, because I love the song and I've been following these guys for a long time. And when I, uh, yeah, when I thought of writing this song, uh, it was it was actually it was a, it was, it was a, one of my friends' idea. You know, they told me maybe you know, I should I should try you know, re, you know, try doing something similar. And I I got hesitated because I was very uh, I was very nervous about the fact that you know I'm, I'm, I'm uh, recreating a song that has already been out there. You know, because nowadays like writing a song. Is, it's very skeptical. You have to be skeptical about it, especially when you're recreating, because it can lead up to many things, many problems. Uh, uh, but yeah, I thought he's what I thought he's a song that I, I sort of like, you know, got the idea from those guys, and uh, it's a, it's a song that I, I've released just about a month ago. It's doing pretty okay for now, and yeah. That's a very interesting inspiration. Wow, I like it because I also kind of like the song. I really like the song. I told you. Yeah. After this, please. Yay! Okay. Hashtag is Nation. How how are you feeling about the music scene in Kenya? The music scene in Kenya? Yeah. It's amazing. Like the you know, music scene in Kenya is amazing. Like you guys have some big artists in Africa. Like what are some of the biggest artists you know in Africa at the moment? Sati Sol is one of them. Uh, I believe Sati Sol is Kenyan. Uh, for, for as long as I've known them, you know, they've been Kenyan. So I'm like, yeah, I think Sati Sol is uh, yeah, Kenyan. And there's like many different other artists nowadays that are coming out of Kenya that are doing pretty fine, you know, uh, amongst the big East African musicians as well. Technology is doing us a bad one, but at White Five Four on Facebook, White Five Four channel on Twitter, hashtag is Bounce Nation. Well, in the middle of very good conversation, I don't know why. Anyway, watch any kings. No, it's such a nice note. So amazing, man. So I came here. I like was very inspired. Na atodi. Yeah. The original one. That Just the man. Why do you look so different? And why do you keep doing that to me? But why do you look so different in the video? <laughs> Hey. Um, I, I had, well after because I showed that video. I was um, I was in a, uh, I was in Af East Africa earlier this. Uh, uh -huh. this year before I showed the video for Shigaba and Atoti, and I did some few more other busy videos there. So that was a while back actually. Before when I showed those videos, it was a while back. So when I got back here, I had to you know I had to I had to. It's been a long time, so I have to change my hair kind of a bit. So. I, I think that's the reason why I look a bit different is that I took my, my hair is no longer the same anymore. So Yo, that's, that's just one of the big factors. Uh -huh. you're, yeah. you're very different in your video. You're so yeah, chill yeah. right here with me in the interview, but the video, eh, you look like you're, you know, you, you have this 
we will call it presence. Yes, there's a very, very huge presence. Not that you don't have it here. It's just, it's very toned down. Is this how you are normally? No, normally? Sorry, can you ask that question again, please? Are you always this chill in, 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 when you're not performing or you're not in a video? Are you always this cool, calm, and collected? <laughs> well, <laughs> I mean, I'm just, the people who know me will probably answer that question a bit better. But like this, yeah, for me, I'll probably say like this is because I like, I like, I like doing my work. Like when I'm on stage or when I'm doing a busy video, I like really, you know, getting that energy going. But once, once I'm off stage, I also like being, you know, just, just a normal guy, you know, because I, I believe in, you know, living a normal life. You don't always have to be a, a musician everywhere you go. And plus, you know, everybody hates their work, you know? So you cannot be doing your work everywhere you go. Sometimes if you need a bit of a piece or if you need to relax a little bit, uh -huh. uh, maybe sometimes you just drift a little bit of the music, just a little bit. Of, and that's me. Like, I like, uh, I yes. like I, when, I, when I'm at home with my family and everything, I like just putting the music aside. I like, I like putting, you know, the little image aside and just be, be Ali for a second, you know? Mm. I, I like that it's, it's, a, it's a refreshing change. Like I'm not seeing you out of a video with yeah. silver and gold all up in your neck, teeth, grills, hair. I see. It's it's refreshing. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for being honestly. Strong. I'm not gonna lie. It's not my cup of tea, but um, it's something that you know you see every day on the music. You know, it, it's like a lot of artists they wear like you know they they follow it. If you're in a busy video, you gotta have like this specific image that you gotta present. Uh, to you know, to to you know, to to look appealing or to yeah, to just match the industry standard. Like you, you just have to leave up, leave an image. You know that 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 sits right in people's eyes. That's what bigger artist is. You know, whether you're whether you're writing music or whether you just dress yourself to you know to present yourself to a crowd, you have to look good enough for the crowd to actually look at you and be like, oh, this is an artist. Especially in a busy video, you have to, you know, you have to look like an artist. Otherwise, it's going to, I don't know, the way people receive that image is going to be a bit different. And uh, being a musician is all about selling images sometimes. Uh, it doesn't have to be negative, mm -hmm. uh, and it doesn't have to be positive either, but just whatever. And you think that works for the people, that's what you go with. And for me, like, I, you know, that's how I like to look at it when I'm on stage or when I'm, you know, when I'm connected with my crowd, sometimes I, you have to go that extra length of uh, exactly what they want to see. And yeah, so I, I be this guy. Mm. Mm -hmm. I, I could not have said it better myself. Thank you. I, it, it looks yeah. like technology has done once again. Oh, there you are. All right. So last thing I'd like is maybe give us your social handles so that we can get over there and follow. Yeah, funny. I, you, if you guys know him, you know, you got to give my, you know, my big uh, shout out to them. Because, you know, I try reaching them, but, you know, like, being a small artist sometimes, you know, you cannot reach to everybody. But, um, yeah, my, uh, my social handles are uh, uh, on Instagram. You, you can find me uh, on Instagram, Alotondo. Uh, same with Facebook, YouTube, everywhere. It's just under the same name, Alotondo. Spotify and all the major streamings that you can probably think of. Uh, I have a count, it'll parade there as well. Uh, so 